Hey guys, welcome to Let's Talk Algorithms. This is Vithalam and today we'll be solving the problem. Construct binary trees from pre-order and in-order traversal. Given pre-order and in-order traversal of a tree, construct the binary tree. So this is what we get in the input. So you have, say this is the workbook. Let's discuss the problem and uh, the kind of input we get and see, figure out an algorithm which basically solves the uh, given question. So we get a pre-order and in-order um, traversal solution, like you get two lists or two arrays. So this is a very interesting problem because you need to understand the tree traversals clearly for you to figure out how to solve this question. So let's um, recap how tree traversals work. So there are three types of tree traversals um, in terms of um, binary trees. So you have in order, which does left, root, right, and you have pre order, which is root, left, right, and you have post order, which is basically left, right, and root comes at the end. So the question says that we get in order and pre order traversal um, list and then we have to figure out how to build a tree from them. So as you can see, pre-order says root left right. So you already know that tree is the root of the uh, tree we are going to create. And then pre-order also has left and right and after the root. So I mean, um, you also can understand that 9 and 20 are the basically children of the root three. So one thing we can do is, uh, so the algorithm would look something like this. So the first element in the pre-order is the root, right? And everything, actually if you see um, anything, since in order is basically left, root, right, root sits in the middle, right? So we know three is a root. So if we ch check for three in, in order, you can see that everything towards, um, to the left of three is basically the left subtree and everything to the right of three is a right subtree. So when you look at the solution, um, I mean, this is the result. So three is a root and everything towards the left of three, basically nine is the left subtree and everything towards the right of three, uh, 1527 is the right of, is the right subtree. So we could use this logic, everything to the left of the root in, in order is belongs in the left subtree, right? And right on the right subtree. All right, so one thing we can do is apparently, you know, recursively use step one, use uh, one and two to build the tree. So what we are going to do first, uh, take every pre-order starting element as the, you know, root and then figure out all the left elements um, on the left side of the that element in, in order, which is basically nine here, and see, do the same thing for on the right side. So you would do something like, you know, on a very pseudo code level, root equal to pre-order, you know, node of pre-order of zero. And then what you're going to do, root dot left is equal to whatever the function, you know, build three, of pre-order comma in order of left of zero, you know, left of zero. So, and root dot right is equal to build tree of pre-order you know, after whatever nine, three, you start from one 
or wherever the the current index ends in in order, which is basically two to the towards the end. So yeah, I mean you basically take the first element in pre-order all the time, um, build the left subtree and the right, right subtree recursively. Let's start writing the code. Uh, it will be more obvious when I mean, we put together some code. Let, I, I commented that out. So one first thing we could check for is um, the negative conditions, as in if you get a empty arrays, basically you can't build a tree. So pre-order in order is zero, then you basically return nil and go nil is null. All right. So let's say your root, let's call it root. Root is equal to pre-order one second. No. Root value is equal to pre-order of zero. So we have three here. And then you can say root index is equal to zero, right? We start with zero. What we're going to do is in the given in order um, array, you're going to check So what we are going to do is we are going to traverse the in in um, the in order array. Then we change. Let me copy over. All right. So what we are going to do is so for every start element of the pre order we are going to find um, the index of that element in the in order. That is basically because that is how we distinguish the left part and the right part uh, for building the tree. So you're just going to increment the root index until we find the value in the in order. Once you find though, so let's say left is equal to you recursively call build tree. And what you're going to do is you can break the array so you will send you will not send the first element anymore because we already processed it will you will send the first element to whatever root index value and then in the in order we pass 0 to whatever you know root index So in the right subtree, we are going to call build tree of pre-order of root index plus one to end of pre-order. Right. And then you're going to pass in order root index plus one length of pre order. And then finally, you can just return tree node. Value is root value. left element left subtree is basically left right is r so what we are doing is to the left subtree you're passing only these values 9 20 15 7 so when i say 1 2 root index plus 1 so here we would only pass 1 to whatever the root index value if it's 1 here you will pass one element from here so you just pass nine to the build tree and for in order um, you pass zero to whatever the number of elements 
starting from here until you found the actual root. So this rec recursively builds the tree. Let's run the code. If you see the expected output and output matches, all we are doing is finding um, the first element, considering it as a root, and dividing all the elements to the left side as a left subtree and right side elements as a right subtree and recursively, recursively building the tree, basically. Let's submit the code. It gets accepted, 48 seconds. All right, if you have any questions, uh, please let me know in the comments. And if you like the videos, uh, please subscribe to the channel. And uh, I'll probably make a iterative version of this. If you guys want it, let me know in the comments. Thank you.